I mean, first of all, I would hope that in 10 years we won't be asking if drones belong in healthcare, but uh, we'll be asking how we ever kind of managed without it, right? That would be the, the aim. And I think in the emergency sector is one of the first that drones really can have a huge impact in. And I think there are, let's say, three bigger themes in emergency. There's one, the emergency and the, let's say, critical care logistics, right? For example, blood and organ transport or emergency medication as well. Also, mm -hmm. uh, medical equipment, of course. Yeah. Like um, defibrillators and, and oxygen, etc. right? Exactly, because all that, if you can transport it, um, be more efficient, you don't have, for example, to buy it and store it um, in, well, in, in, a, in a tighter grid, right? So it's also, a, it will be a reduction in health costs as well. Similar, um, for example, also for the routine health logistics, which... Um, I'm more uh, in, uh, in the, for example, for a huge, uh, biggest laboratory, actually, um, private laboratory in Switzerland that I'm also working for, um, having a lab uh, sample transportation, not only emergency, but just uh, as a, a practical use, because uh, in the laboratory medicine, all the equipment is quite expensive, also in the hospitals, and if you can kind of um, widen the net a bit and have an efficient logistics between it, um, it's also will hopefully reduce also healthcare costs, which now in Switzerland are again very under under um, the way, hog eye of, of the public um, to reduce the, the healthcare costs. So disaster response, I think, also here in Switzerland, which will be very um, important with the mountains, which are um, for hikers or skiers, some, sometimes if they have an accident, it's very hard to get to them or an avalanche. So it can be of, um, or also depending on the weather, maybe a helicopter cannot reach them in time or um, it's too dangerous to fly. So you can send in a drone or you can drop a kit or something where like, for example, people around, standing around could already do some first emergency work on the, on the patients. And of course, um, well, disaster relief um, and also um, disease control would also be another other business case, yeah. let's say, or use case. Yeah. yeah, I think another very interesting use case that I uh, was also looking at was, uh, you know, search and rescue. 